Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. We expect temperatures in the 50s this evening, but dropping down to 50 at 9 o'clock and then 46 at 11 p.m. as the sky clears out. And that clear night means some chilly temperatures tonight, upper 30s, low 40s. You know, there might even be a few patches of frost to some of those colder spots around the Miami Valley, some of those valley areas. And uh, don't be surprised to see that late tonight, tomorrow morning. But then increasing clouds through the day tomorrow, upper 50s at noon, around 60 with cloudy skies at 5 p.m. And late afternoon and evening, the chance of a shower will be starting to rise. Mostly clear tonight, low temperatures heading down around 40 in our weather headline. We'll see some early day sun on Thursday, but that late day shower chance and even the possibility of some thunder as we get to tomorrow evening, tomorrow night. Some showers also around on Friday, perhaps a little thunder thrown into the mix. A cool day on Friday and the potential for some frost Saturday morning as we could slip off into the upper 30s. Low temperatures tonight, upper 30s to about 40 here in the southern part of the Miami Valley, mostly in the upper 30s as you go north of town. And then we'll find the high temperatures tomorrow afternoon, ranging from near 60 north. Uh, mostly, though, low 60s over the region as those clouds will be rolling in and eventually that chance of some late day rain. And we get back in on the cooler weather on Friday with high temperatures upper 50s to about 60. Right now, partly cloudy skies showing up on the Duncan Oil Company camera in Springfield. It's dry tonight on live Doppler 2 HD. Still some clouds swinging across the area, but they're already rapidly thinning out through eastern Indiana and far western Ohio. And that clearing trend will build into the Dayton area this evening. And then finally, late tonight, a few clouds from the system out west will start to spill into our area as this uh, low pressure center out over the Plain States. Cold front combination heads our way uh, late tomorrow. Tomorrow night we'll see that increased risk of some showers moving in. Currently in Dayton 57, a northwest wind at 16 miles per hour. 42 percent the relative humidity with that barometer on the rise. And our weather checkers tonight, Jeff Cador and Bell Center only at 54 degrees. Uh, Tom Wyckoff in Springfield 54, but the low steaders 59 in Jamestown. Barbara Richards 62 in Kettering, Jason Thompson, Brookville 62, but David Wessler out in New Paris uh, in the upper 50s. You're seeing pretty much clear sky for a while tonight. Late tonight, some of those high level clouds, a few scattered ones moving in, and then increasing clouds through the day tomorrow. And then finally, as we get to late afternoon and toward the evening hours, the chance of some showers, perhaps even a thunderstorm moving into the area, and still some scattered showers expected around the area on Friday as another disturbance swings on through. Tonight, mostly clear and chilly. Overnight, low around 40. Northwest winds 10 to 15, dropping off to under 10 miles per hour. Increasing clouds tomorrow. The chance for a late day shower will get up to 62 degrees with the sunrise just about back to 630 now. 6 a.m. 41. Look for mostly clear skies, partly to mostly sunny conditions at 950. And then we're 58 at noon, mostly cloudy at 3 p.m. 62, 58 at 6 o'clock with that chance of a shower. Still a chance of some showers mainly Friday afternoon, morning low 40 with a high of 58. A chance of frost Saturday morning 30 high 62 and then rain likely for Mother's Day and a cool day highs in the 50s but back into the 60s next week.